Hi and welcome back to my channel, my name is Lisa. In this video I will share a few of our meals that we have uh, this uh, weekend and uh, week. And uh, I will start by uh, the lunch we had on Sunday. Uh, we will start with this um, chicken and uh, oat rice and curry sauce. This is actually a new uh, um, product in our stores. Uh, so it was very exciting to try this. It's like oats rice in some sort that you just gonna um, boil up with water and salt and let it uh, simmer for about 12 minutes with a lid on top and uh, it, would it was actually really nice we liked it a lot in my family and uh, I hope that you will try it if you see that also in your store and with this as I said I just had some already uh, curry powder package that I just uh, mixed with some uh, water and butter. And here is the rice boiling. And as a side, we just had some uh, leftover iceberg lettuce and we had some corn that I just mixed together. And here is the result. It was very, very uh, good. Uh, so the next uh, thing I will show you is the dinner for uh, this day because this was the lunch. So today it's uh, Sunday and we're soon gonna eat some dinner and we are just gonna have some pasta with tuna fish and uh, so you need one can of this tuna fish it says uh, that you should have uh, 200 grams but this is just 170 grams but it will do uh, I have some crushed tomatoes some uh, cream and some oil you're just gonna fry up some garlic with the oil here in my cute little garlic container here I have the garlic uh, some black pepper, some salt and also some chili flakes it says chili flakes but I just have this chili pepper so I guess it's the same take as much as you like and uh, I have just this um, penne pasta of course you can have spaghetti also so this is, will be the dinner today so the only thing you need to do is just fry up some garlic um, that you have um, grained uh, very finely and then you add the uh, tomatoes and the tuna fish and uh, all the spices that I showed you and in the end I'm just adding the cream. So here is uh, my food, all paid it up. It was a really, really uh, delis delicious uh, food. And uh, let's go on to uh, Monday's dinner. So on Monday we just had some fallow sausage wok with oat rice. And I had just uh, pre-sliced the fallow sausage that I had left. And I'm just gonna have that uh, together with uh, some wok mix and uh, some soy sauce and some uh, sweet chili sauce, some garlic and some water i know at the meal plan i said that i wanted to do like a sausage stroganoff but i um, changed my mind and wanted to do this instead so i had some uh, sweet chili sauce in my fridge and also some soy sauce and uh, so i had to use some of that uh, with this so i'm gonna start by just uh, fry up my uh, fallow sausage and then I will add my uh, vuk um, veggies and then I will add the water with the soy sauce, the sweet chili sauce and the garlic.
so here is my plate it was a really nice meal and uh, i hope you will try it and also try out the uh, oat rice if you have that in your country my kids was uh, a bit skeptic but that's you cannot please them all all the time <laughs> Uh, on uh, Tuesday we have this um, hot pizza sandwiches with pineapple, ham and cheese. Uh, I hope you have already seen the collab, uh, what I made this from yesterday's video. A really really uh, nice uh, meal as well. On Wednesday we just had some uh, fish nuggets with fries and ketchup and also some uh, broccoli on the side. I had an evening meeting at work, so uh, my uh, spouse made the dinner for this day, and uh, it was really good. Today is Thursday, and I will make a lasagna. So I bought this um, giant pack. It's I think it's let's see, 2.179 kilograms. I don't know what exactly it is in pounds, but um, it's quite a lot. So I don't. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna use all of this maybe like a third or half of this and make a quite large lasagna and I also bought two of these uh, pasta sauces with garlic garlic <laughs> and uh, also some uh, pasta uh, lasagna noodles and I'm gonna do my own uh, bechamel sauce as well so I will um, just start by um, cutting this in smaller piece and like in half and fry this up for you and you will see how I make my lasagna. The first thing I'll do is just uh, cook the the ground beef and pork and also on the side I just made my own bechamel. It's just with the, the flour and the butter and milk and you can also have some uh, salt and some white pepper. I actually forgot to have that in my sauce but um, it turned out okay anyway and uh, I also put two uh, garlic breads in the oven and I have also put some broccoli on the stove to boil so we can have that with this and it was a really really uh, nice recipe and uh, I really like lasagna it was a very long time uh, since we had that so that's a really really nice meal and easy to make This is the way this lasagna turned out. It smelled so good when I uh, took it out from the oven. I just served it some, with some broccoli and also some garlic bread and it was really really good. So this is the last um, meal that I will show you in this video. Thank you so so much for watching and I hope I see you in my next video. And uh, take care everyone. Bye!